This is a quick video about iPhone displays, refresh rates. Here's some old telephones, most of which have been dropped by me. The older phones used LCD screens, which as you can see here, they just fade a new frame over the top of the last frame from top to bottom 60 times per second. Starting with the iPhone 10, they switched away from LCD displays and started using OLED displays, which actually look very different in slow-mo. You can see the screen updating many more times per second with these black bars traveling down the screen. This happens 240 times per second. There's 240 lines traveling down the screen every second. However, it's not actually updating the frame that many times. Only every fourth line down the screen is changing the frame. So even though the display may be being refreshed 240 times a second with every fourth line changing the frame, it's only updating 60 times per second. So it's really just a 60 FPS, 60 Hertz video display. The iPhone 13 Pro also seems to be capable of drawing a new frame every fourth refresh of the screen. However, this phone is capable of sending 480 lines down the screen every second, which if we divide by four, every fourth line gives us an effective refresh rate of 120 hertz. Although the black bars are completely invisible to the human eye, the fact that there are twice as many frames per second means that all the animations are much smoother to look at. This seems to vary depending on what you're doing. As you can see here on the home screen, it seems to be updating at 120 hertz, drawing a new frame every fourth bar. In the news app, it seemed to be doing 80 hertz, where every sixth line of the screen would draw a new frame. And in the camera app, it seems to be matching the previous phone at 60 hertz. So I suppose in order to save battery, depending on what you're doing with the phone, it will use different refresh rates. So even though it always draws the screen 480 times per second, it's only updating them when it sees fit. And there we go, I just thought it was a pretty interesting video because I've spent hours of my life staring at these things, and it turns out I've never actually seen what they're doing right in front of my eyeballs.